New technology at Tampa International Airport will help you get to your plane more quickly. Electronic gates are up and running as of this week. They check your boarding pass before you board the shuttle. And on your side's Christine McClarty is at the airport with the details. When you're at the Tampa Airport and you're headed to the airside checkpoint, you have to take a shuttle. And usually you're checking your boarding pass with women like these. But now you'll be checking it with machines like these. Before getting on the shuttle, you're used to hearing... Next morning pass, please. Thank you. Now, instead, you can expect these electronic gates. Ma'am, why don't you come right over here? Why don't you scan your... Put your boarding pass right there. There you go. The process is simple. Scan your boarding pass, and if you're at the right shuttle, you'll get the green light and the gates swing open. Anytime you can streamline the process, it's an improvement. And if electronics and technology can help with that, then I'm all for it. Airport officials expect the new tech to cut lines in half. I think that's hugely advantageous. I don't have to get to the airport as early. I find it easier. It's easy to check in, check out on the go instead of waiting in long lines. There's another new addition. These two devices you see over here are automated boarding pass kiosks, self-service kiosks. So customers that have forgotten their boarding pass or don't have a boarding pass, instead of going down to our ticketing level and going to the airline, they can simply print their boarding pass right here. The new kiosks and e-gates cost about $700,000. An investment to get you on the shuttle and to your plane quicker, even if you don't really want to leave sunny Florida. Going back to Minnesota, the cold. <laughs> the cold. Yes. The first of the four E-Gates opened just this week, and we can expect to see the rest open before the end of the year. Reporting at Tampa International Airport, Christine McClarty, 8 on your side.